Toronto FC returns home following an opening weekend 2-1 win in Seattle to face DC United here in Toronto on Saturday. Some people are saying this game is more important than their first one simply because it's at home, it's back at BMO Field. With all the support and with all the off-season uh, signings, more eyes are going to be on this game than probably the opener last weekend. And hopefully, you know, it will pay off tomorrow in the game. Um, keep mentioning it's, a, it's an important game because, you know, if we don't get a result tomorrow, then I suppose the first win against Seattle, it counts for nothing. One of the biggest concerns coming into this game is going to be the weather. After one of the harshest winters uh, Toronto's had in recent memory, the pitch at BMO Field is a bit mushy. Ryan Nelson today said that TFC is going to go from two extremes, where last week they played in Seattle on a hard surface, on an artificial surface, which isn't ideal for the game. And on this weekend, the pitch is going to be questionable again. Um, obviously, with this winter it's had, um, the ground staff have had virtually no time to do um, much on the field. So, um, so um, yeah, it could be it could be interesting. We're not really sure. It could be um, a, a bowling green. It could be a, a bit different. So um, um, we had a look at it on um, <coughs> on Tuesday. So so we've got a fair idea what it's going to be like. Um, but we'll we'll keep it in house. Both Michael Bradley and Ryan Nelson today said that one of the keys to this game could be shutting down Eddie Johnson in the same way TFC shut down Clint Dempsey last weekend in Seattle. They were very physical with Clint, the U.S. international, which even brought Jurgen Klinsmann to come out and, and complain about the way some of the league's star uh, players are treated. But Bradley said they're going to be harsh but fair in the challenge. Uh, it's a physical league for sure, um, but when you look around the world, all the best games um, are physical. They're hard. Teams compete uh, at the highest level, and you know for. For us, when, when we look back at last weekend, um, you know, we feel like we, we, we played hard, we competed hard, we, we left everything we had on the field, but in an honest, fair way. Weather reports are calling for rain and freezing temperatures tomorrow in Toronto, which shouldn't make the pitch conditions at BMO Field any better. That shouldn't, however, keep the sellout crowd of 22,000 from coming out to watch one of the most anticipated TFC games in recent memory. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Kurt Larson.